What up, man and all stars? This is your boy Shocker 360, and here we are playing against Seville. Seville is one of my rivals on Xbox. Uh, we go at it every single year. I think last year we ended up uh, three and one. I ended up beating him three times. He beat me one time, but you know it goes into a Twitter war after every time we play a game. So you know I had to post this game because this was actually a classic game, e either uh, or one of the most epic games that I I played in a while. But uh, here you go. Uh, here we go with Davis, man. He's a beast right here. I got him in the right position. It's an outside wide receiver, and it gets me the catch right there. Uh, definitely, uh, Seville is uh, doing a great job moving the ball and, uh, you know, doing his thing with the Dallas Cowboys. Uh, now, uh, one of the things that just, uh, you know, he's, he, uh, he got, I think he got lucky in some of the plays here. Uh, like, right here, I missed a tackle. And um, then I had other plays where he was throwing into coverage, and definitely, he, I don't know how he caught it, but the computer gave it to him. Uh, he leaves my players wide open um, a lot of the times here. I just am scoring right after he scores. So it's going to be a, a really good match. We're going to go at it. Like I said, this is a rivalry, uh, rivalry game. And definitely, it's going to be uh, an awesome uh, ending here in this game. So as you can see here. Just waiting. He's playing uh, the famous fag defense this year from Madden 13. Let's go ahead and just wait here. Pocket presence. And as you can see here, X gets wide open. Uh, with Randy Moss jumps up and gets the ball for a touchdown. Uh, again, but Sivio is not going to let himself uh, go like that. And it's uh, still the second quarter, so he has a lot of time to drive the ball. Like I said, I'm uh, I'm, I'm really excited about playing Sivio. We The last time we played was like a month ago. And we finally get to have a game in. I think he works uh, during the day, and uh, therefore he only... In, look at this right here. This is the stuff that I was talking about. My linebacker was not in the position to get the pick. Uh, he never turned around and did not get it. Send the blitz here, um, and he gets a touchdown. He, I don't know. I just moved them out of the way, I guess. And uh, just little things like that that kept him in the game. But again, I answered back once again with another touchdown. Back-to-back-to-back uh, -to -back -to -back touchdown, just like that. In a couple of plays, and I'm already scoring. Uh, definitely, I think Seville got lucky in this in this game. But uh, I don't know if you guys know who Seville is, but he has also numerous games uh, against with Master Chappie and uh, other games with uh, Addy Cards. And definitely, he likes to play a lot of the commentators. If not, he's one of the favorites we like to play against because he likes to talk a lot of smack. Like I say, he would go on Twitter wars. But look at this right here. He threw a pick right on this drive. He forced it, had a cover four on this play, actually 3-4 cover four. And um, therefore, he, I got the ball back, and, and we're going into the third quarter. And in this game, I'm trying to send the blitz again. I'm just playing him uh, the same way, um, sending the blitz, and then I'm going into max coverage. But, uh, no, definitely my defense uh, needs to tighten up. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and tighten it up here in the fourth quarter as we go. And he gets right here. Look at this. I'm going to manually sack him with a DT manual turbo blitz. And uh, nothing happened. Tony Romo got out of the way. And he scored a touchdown. Uh, here we go. I uh, go for it on 4th and 14. This was his uh, defensive drive. My turnover. You know, everybody has one of those in the game. And uh, he has a chance here to make it happen and win this game. So as you can see here, man, he's throwing into coverage. My linebackers are there. They're just not picking up their hands. I'm um, just going to go ahead and try to lock this up right here, this run. You know, um, just uh, make him have a hard time to get in there. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go into the 4th quarter. And uh, and we get our receiver wide open here, going towards the sideline. Um, I'm I'm using the 49ers. I got a new depth chart. I'll, I'll probably post it up pretty soon. But Manningham is a beast. Uh, look at this right here. Keep <laughs> keep trucking right here towards the end, all the way to the end zone. Uh, I I go here right here. This is a, a, a tactic tournament tactic that you guys should know. As you hear, we have three minutes in the clock. I decide to go onside kick because uh, it's accelerated clock, so the time is going to go uh, run really fast. So he gets the ball right here. As you can see here, I'm trying to let him score so I can get the ball back and try to score and go for two-point conversion. And uh, and right here, I start playing him defense because uh, he's not he doesn't want to score. And that's a, a mental factor. He doesn't want to score. So, you know, right there, he lost momentum in his drive. And, you know, I'm definitely, look at this right here, man. My players are right on the spot for the pick. And they're just not getting to his players for some reason. But, you know, he's making plays. Third and three. And uh, here we go. We're going to go ahead and try to lock this up right here. 
right in the fourth and one. He decides to kick a field goal, big mistake, uh, but he either could have gambled or, or go for three points and try to stop me. I guess he he's uh, feeling good on defense because he stopped me one time, but uh, he tries the onside kick and not going to happen this time. I'm going to go ahead and try to run it back. Oh, good thing I didn't pitch it back right there. And that would have been disaster, but look at this right here. This, this was my lucky break. Uh, it was actually... Uh, third down and I got that one right there almost a pick, but I got it Let's go ahead and 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 run it right here with a QB Slide we got one minute left in the game Check this out Nice touchdown right here. We answer back, but I know Seville is not gonna go out like a punk So he's gonna fight it out So I'm trying to do everything I can I'm showing you my my adjustments. I'm just missed tackle right here really dumb mistake uh, He span a uh, spun out of it I'm going to go ahead and send right here, uh, you know, max coverage defense. I'm uh, using the quarter defense, and I'm combining it with the 3-4 defense and 4-6 defense and everything. So I'm trying to just send the blitz, uh, send as many less people as possible, but he is blocking his running back. Therefore, it's uh, giving me a hard time to send that blitz down the middle of the field. Uh, he gets wide open. This play drives it all the way to the sideline, man. He's getting that momentum. What's going on in this game? But look at this right here. Uh, let's go ahead and try to lock this up. And, nah, nothing. Nothing there. Let's go ahead. Second try. Send the A-gap this time. He gets there. Uh, nothing there again. He has to block the running back. If not, I'm going to A-gap him all day. So he's better block the running back. So it's his third and goal. Right here, I should have moved my my cornerback or my linebacker to the outside. Look at this right here. We stopped him right in the one-yard line with five seconds left to go in this game. Now, this is up to you. First five people to guess what happened in this game. Get any guide in the, in the website that you guys want. What do you think happened in that game? I'll be posting it up tomorrow. Check out the results later. This was Shaka Tuhisi from ManAlsers.com. Well, I was just kidding, guys. Of course, I was going to show you what's going to happen in this game. But look at this right here. We got this guy in man coverage. We get the nice diving epic catch for the, the win right here. And we go on top in this series, uh, two to one against Seville. I'm pretty sure he's going to want that rematch, and he's going to come back beasting. So I can't wait for you guys to give you guys uh, the next game. So this was an awesome win, victory, 35-31, with an epic diving interception to win this game. Until later, guys, this was Shaka Tuesday from ManandAllStars.com. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you follow us at Man and All Stars on Twitter, at Man and All Stars, or at Man and Battle, so you want to hit, hit us up with the game. Later, and bye. This was Shaka360 from ManAlsters.com.